Hello, this is Alan MacDonald. The five videos in my Geometric Calculus playlist give an introduction to geometric calculus. They are a follow-up to my Geometric Algebra playlist. I've chosen mostly to limit myself to the concepts involved in the Fundamental Theorem of Geometric Calculus, the subtitles of the videos. The videos are based on my book, Vector and Geometric Calculus. Click on the link to visit the book's web page. Some knowledge of vector calculus is presumed for these videos, but not for the book. Let me read through a short introduction. Geometric calculus is the extension of geometric algebra to calculus, derivatives and integrals. Its crown jewel is the fundamental theorem of geometric calculus. The theorem unifies and generalizes the fundamental theorem of scalar calculus, Gauss's and Stokes's theorems from vector calculus, Stokes's theorem from differential forms theory, and Cauchy's theorem from complex variable theory, among others. The statement of the theorem is simple and elegant. It requires geometric calculus for its formulation. This is the form of the fundamental theorem of scalar calculus that we will generalize to the fundamental theorem of geometric calculus. Here are the parts of this playlist. Part 4, the fundamental theorem, is where we're heading. Let's look at the parts that will get us there. In the fundamental theorem here, the action takes place on the closed interval of the real line. We will generalize this to more general kinds of objects, curves and surfaces and their higher dimensional analogs. Such objects will be called manifolds. We have here the derivative of a function defined on the interval AB. We need to generalize this to the derivative of functions defined on manifolds. These derivatives are called vector derivatives. We have here the integral of a function defined on AB. We need to generalize to the integral of functions defined on manifolds. These are called directed integrals. Notice the slide numbers at the lower right uh, in case you need to refer to them. Also notice the outline at the top reflecting the outline I've just given. And as I move to the next slide, which is the beginning of the manifold part of this playlist, you'll see that the subtopics under manifolds appear.